A boulder that fell on houses in Valenzuela City killed two people while two others were badly injured. Miguel Ortilla has that story live from Valenzuela City. Miguel? Yes, Pia, it's been uh, eight hours since this uh, rescue operation began and rescuers are uh, still trying to recover the man that is said to be uh, still uh, trapped underneath the rubble here in uh, Barangay Cabatuan in uh, Ugong, Valenzuela. Earlier this morning, rescuers were able to bring three children who were also trapped in the rubble. They were rushed to the hospital. Unfortunately, one of the children didn't make it and uh, died while on the way. At around 10 in the morning, Valenzuela rescue teams received calls for help after a huge boulder fell on several shanties under a bridge. Reported trapped under the rubble are three children, one five-year-old, one three-year-old, and a nine-year-old uh, child, Christian Serrano, and a certain Rodel Pugoy. Rescuers rushed the three children to the hospital, but Christian Serrano did not make it. The Valenzuela Engineering Department is still drilling through the huge block of stone using their jackhammers to retrieve the body of Rodel Pugoy. One of the survivors we've talked to earlier, Jeric Galliora, recalled the incident. He says that first they just heard a sharp sound. Before they knew it, the huge block came into their houses already. City engineers said that these residents have long been advised to leave their hazard-prone area, but uh, they continue to refuse. After this incident, officials have uh, evacuated only 15 families so far. And uh, this lot is supposedly owned by the National Grid Corporation. And uh, the Valenzuela officials are now calling on uh, that agency to find possible relocation sites for almost 2,000 residents which are still living underneath this bridge. Pia, as we speak, uh, rescue operations are still ongoing. The Philippine National Red Cross tells us that uh, Pugoy, the said victim still under the rubble, is already dead. However, they still uh, are trying to recover him. They're having, a difficult, having difficulty in recovering his body because the huge block that fell is made of adobe and uh, it is just very difficult for them to penetrate the stone. They also tried bringing in some backhoes but they just uh, couldn't make it. We were also told that uh, this operation might uh, take until midnight until they recover the body. Pia?